Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Dust, an Elysian Tale. In the last episode, what did we do? I don't even... We did side stuff, right? We just went around and did some side stuff and whatnot. Also, if you hear the fan in the background, sorry if you hear the blowing. It sounds like there's wind in my room. No, there's a fan. It's fucking hot. Happy 4th of July, everyone. I know it's Sunday already when this is getting uploaded, but I'm recording this on Independence Day for America. So, anyways, in the last episode of Side Stuff, this episode, I'm going to start with a couple side things. I looked through my quest log for a minute. One thing I was reminded Welcome of back. is the side quest that we're supposed to get a doll of Fidget for somebody. So, let's see if this guy actually has one or, toys, can or let me know how to get one. Specifically, Nimbat dolls? Nimbat. A Nimbat doll? You mean like your flying friend there? I don't believe we have anything like that in stock. Well, do you, do you know do you know pleased. where I can get I'm one? I'm certain I could craft one for you, assuming I had the proper materials. God damn it. Well, let's hope I already Let have the materials. See. With some cotton fabric and dye, I'm certain I could make a wonderful Nimbat doll for you. Let's hope I already have this shit. Let us see, Dust. I'm feeling a little uneasy about this whole thing. What's to feel uneasy about, Fidget? You're adorable. I think I might have him make another fidget doll that I'll just hang on to. Forever. Forever. Ah, <laughs> excellent. You brought all the material. Oh, sweet. Would See, like I already have what now? I need. I knew it. I knew it. Wonderful. Now, if your companion will just lie down on this fabric. What? Hey, you're not tracing me. Oh, well, I do need some sort of measurement. <laughs> just do it, fidget, you son of a bitch. Quit being such a. Give me a pen. I'll draw it myself. Uh. There. Done. See how well I've captured everything. Yeah, your nuanced curve. You mean your egg-shaped body? See, you can use this to measure your doll. It's perfect. No, it really isn't. Actually, that's the worst drawing I've ever seen. Just shut up and make this stupid doll. Okay, okay. Just give me a moment. Uh, some cotton here, some stitches there. Uh, maybe a little more cotton up there in the head area? I don't think you're accurately capturing the pure size of Fidget's head. <laughs> My head is just fine. You're the ones wearing those stupid hats. Maybe you two could form a stupid hat club. Oh boy. And voila! Another happy customer. And I even had enough material to make an extra yes, one. Yes! I know, oh, you know I wanted an extra I one. I wasn't expecting to actually get one. I guess I'll just have to carry it around forever. I actually feel bad giving one of these ugly things to Smobop, but here we go. How ugly are they though? Do we get to look at them? Can I get like a good picture of them? Can we see what they look like? I want to know what it looks like. Smobop, Smobop, bop, bop, deep, bop, bo. Where's that item? I want to see it. Ho. Oh. oh, look at it. It's so fidgety. It doesn't look that bad. Doesn't look accurate, but it doesn't look bad. Back. Anyway, I'm here to check the shop because if he should sell materials, um, the one material I want, I don't give a shit. I'm disconnected from Xbox Live. I don't even know I was connected to Xbox Live. No one cares. Okay, I'm here for two things, sir. I'm here for some imp hides. I need five of them, to be specific. And actually, I think it's all I'm here for now that I think about it. Yeah, that's all I'm here for. Um, that's because another quest. Yes, you've collected five. Return to fail. See, there was fail around here. Mr. Fail, I completely forgot about him. I don't even remember who he is. I just remember he was in this town. Fail, fail, where do you hail? You hail from Aurora, don't be such a failure. Failure. Mm -hmm, my song is so fucking clever. Which guy was it? I don't remember. Which guy was it? I don't remember. Which guy was it? I don't remember. You're not fail, are you? You're not fail. You're Mosca. Mosca Pachoska. You're not fail. You're douche. Where is fail? Where is fail? Is fail one of the guards? I feel like he's one of the guards. I seem to remember it from him being from early on. Bean and Callum. Okay, he's not one of the guards. Who the fuck is fail then? You're not fail either. You're Gihan. Who the fudge is failure? Is fail the one that like was going down into the caves? Man, are we really gonna waste time looking for fail? Seriously, is this the thing that's happening right now? <sighs> God, I wish it wasn't. Certainly wish it wasn't. 
Fail, fail, fail. Where are you, fail? I'm gonna kill you. All right. You better be down. You better be the dude that's chilling down here. Because seriously, right now, I am not. Oh, he's not even down here anymore. Used to be right here. Man. Where'd he go, man? Where'd he go, man? Did I really miss a treasure down here? There's like a, a spot down here where there's, there's a treasure. Did I really miss a treasure? Now I'm in full curious uh, curiosity mood. Um, where the fudge did I miss a treasure at? Oh no, there's a treasure on that screen. Oh, well then, that's good to know. Also, wait, have we been in here? Hold on, what's in here? What does this do? Where does this take me? Have I been here? Where am I? Oh, this takes me back to the top. Sweet. Okay, cool. So I can drop down again. I didn't even... Did I go in that thing before? Did I? Have I already solved that riddle? Have I done that exact reaction before? Man, I'm the best Let's Player ever. You don't even know right now, people. Yeah. Oh, it's another friend. It's another friend. And I need two more keys for him. God damn it. You know what? Let's go get the keys right now. Let's do it. Whoa, giant fucker, get off of me. <sighs> Man, this is a complete fail, if you know what I'm saying. All right, what I'm going to do now, besides go find failure, find Mr. Fail, who should be around here somewhere. Oh, God damn it. God, this is like the best episode ever. This is the best episode of this game you've ever seen. If I was smart, I would just start cutting shit out. But that would just, you know, take away the fucking... I don't know. It really wouldn't take away anything other than you're my all of this waste of time that I'm showing you. These areas are a lot bigger than they feel, man. They're bigger than they feel, man. I feel like failure. You're not fail. You're not fail either. Where's fail? Your name's not Mayor Fail. Is fail the dude that's right here in the exit of this place? Are you fail? You're a fail. God damn it. Okay. Here's your goddamn you know empire, you fool. You for, fail. Great. Here's your payment. If you're willing, I could use your Oh god, you again. have more? I'd like to upgrade our weapons. Beast spears, while primitive, have finely chiseled stone tips that we can use for arrowheads. If you could bring me eight beast spears, I'll buy them for a high price. Oh, sweet. Okay, so in that case, Let's go get some more beast spears for a high price. I don't even know if I have any beast spears yet. So I'm going to go back to the shop over here. And I'm going to buy two keys. And I'm also going to buy beast spears if I've gotten any. I don't remember. That's why these things... That's why these shops exist, my friends. That's why they exist. So first of all, I'm buying two keys because I want to go save that friend. Um, but I am also going to buy beast spears. There's this. I have four of them. I need eight. So I'm just going to buy five, so I have one left over. I don't know what, what that's all about, but it happened. All right, let's go drop off these beast spears, see if he has anything new, new for me, and then we'll go fucking save that friend. How many friends are in this game? I found four so far, and I've saved only two of them, so Here are those who knows how many there are total. Fail. Great. Here's your payment. If you're willing, I could use your You have again. more? Oh. There's a rare material out there that I've heard can be distilled into a very strong lacquer for armor. Of course, I'm talking about slime. If you could bring me four slimy spikes, I feel like I've already coats. gotten spikes uh, and coats, so we might be able to do this one already even as well, even if I don't have the materials already. To be a bit, uh, well, slimy. Spikes and coats. Let's go see if this shopkeeper has. I know I've gotten coats, but I don't remember if I've gotten the spikes. I feel like I've probably gotten both of them. This is the most exciting quest you've ever seen. This back and forth fetch quest. Welcome At the very back. least, I have the money and shit to do this now. Um, let's see. Slime. Slime. Slime coat. Um. Okay, there's slime coats. But I'm not seeming, seeing the slimy spike. So, until I get a slimy spike, we're kind of stuck. Um, as for spy, uh, coats, he only has four of them anyways. Alright, I'll lay off that for now. Shut up, fucker. Okay, so we'll save that one for later. We'll have to wait till we get some slimy spikes. All right, let's get this shit done, man. I want to save that friend. Best episode ever so far. Can't you agree? Do you agree? So I should have, for those of you who are watching this Let's Play and are wondering why this, there wasn't an episode just yesterday, 
as in on July 4th, and I've already said that I'm recording this on July 4th. Um, that's because I didn't really have much time to record on Friday, so instead what I did is on Thursday I recorded more than enough episodes of the other two LPs I was doing. That's why there was just two episodes in a row of those Let's Plays, because I was already working on those. Also, there is bombs over here, and we can use the blow up the thing over here. I didn't even see those. Very useful. Boom, chakalaka. All right, besides saving the friend, which we are going to do right now, um, we'll check out that dark area. But anyway, yeah, that's why I didn't have a lot of time on Friday. In fact, I had almost no time on Friday, and by the time I got home on Friday, it was like super late. Who we got? It's another one of these guys. Really? Two duck guys? Man, first was Meat Boy and then two duck guys? That's not even, what happened to the cleverness? The cleverness is gone. No more cleverness for you, game. That's lame. Can we go down here? Indeed we can. <gasps> More keys! Oh my god! Replenishing the two keys that I just used to get that duck out of there. Now somebody went ahead and told me that the duck is actually the guys who make the music for this game. So, yay. That's actually pretty cool. I didn't know that. Thank you for giving me the heads up on that. Hyper Duck, I believe they were called. Or something like that. So, yeah. I mean, I knew it was Hyper Duck or whatever the hell they're called. I I see the credits when I turn on the game every time, but it didn't even register in my brain that that w that that's where the fucking mascot came from for that for the naming or for that. Okay, you wanna fucking you wanna fucking piece, big man? Get wrecked. Get fucking wrecked, son. You want to fuck a piece. And we're like about on the verge of a level up as well. Okay, so we did that. We saved the friend. We did the quests that I had that I could still do. Get a swig of water because it's hot. What are we doing today? Um, we got the thing to go drop off for the Cinnabon Cavern, the dude there. Can we just go straight there? Um, this is right above the village, right? Let's just go there. I don't know how the hell it still tells me there's items in these areas. Like these first couple areas here. I'm about to go through. There still says there's treasures here. I'm like, where the fuck are these treasures at? Wait. I didn't blow that up. Where do I get some bombs to blow that shit up? I didn't even remember this being up here. Well then, let's find some bombs to blow that shit up while we're around here. On the mean, In the meantime, is there bombs in this area down here? I don't see any. Probably some in the next area down, and you gotta bring one up here to do it, which is fine. We can do that. I can pull that off. In the meantime, let's go down to the village, which is right here, and we're looking for somebody. Who are we looking for? We're looking for Bo Smobop. Smobop. Smobop, ba -dop, ba -ba -ding bang boom. I believe that's his name. Her name. Its name. I don't remember if it was a guy or a girl. I feel like it was a dude. That's why he was all obsessed with the fucking fluffy. That dude, we still have to go get some. Tr Rock truck items for him. I forget the name of the item, but we need to get him still. You, you, Smobop. Here's your dolly. Okay, yeah, I'm Hero Falana. Here's a fidget doll for you. Better than the real thing. Ooh, she's pretty. Here, you can have this. <gasps> can I? What can I have? Thanks, Smobop. Is it a key? Mm, Bob gave it to me a little while ago. He found it near the surface, I think. What is it? Oh, thank you. Enjoy your. Please fidget. tell me it's a key. I love my doll. I love her so much. Oh my god. Oh, that one buck tooth is killing me. What did you give me, anyways? It didn't really say. It didn't really tell me what that bitch gave me. Did it tell me? Uh, wait, in exchange for a wait. Oh, wait! In exchange for the thing she gave this a box? Awesome! That's actually something we need to give. So oh my God, we're going all around circles in. We need a bomb, by the way. I'm looking for a bomb. Thank you, game. Oh man, not another one of you. I need a bomb. Ow! Can somebody please give me a bomb. Damn it! Fuck my shit. Okay, heal. There it is. My God, that was absolutely atrocious. I'm just looking for a bomb, game. Fucking don't, don't you, oh god damn it, son of a bitch. My ability to do combos is dead, but at least I got a level up, yay. Oh god. I just want a bomb. What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? What am I doing with my life? I'm not getting bombs. I'm not gonna be able to find a bomb over here that I can bring all the way the fuck over here. I need to find one that's in the town or something. 
God damn it. Uh, frustrating. I just want a bomb. I just want one bomb. Give me the bomb that I desire, game. Give me the bomb, bomb, bomb that I deserve. First of all, let's use this real quick before I forget. I'm going to go defense because, yeah, defense is good. We're a little behind on that defense, so I'm okay with doing a little bit of defense. Where's the bomb? Is there a bomb over here? Maybe there's one below. I don't know, man. I'm so lost at this point in terms of what I'm doing. I may just cut once I do something relevant instead of waste more time wandering around here like a goddamn jackass. Jackass. Alrighty then. I went ahead and decided to meet you back here in Aurora Village because the box the little girl gave me goes to this guy. Reed, yo, I found your box, son. You found it. Quickly, give it to me. What's inside? Relax, Tell me Reed. what's inside just right now. Just the box? No, no. What's in the, the box? box? Did you hear it whispering to you? The whispers. The lies. Oh god, he hears voices from the box. They told me the box was filled with cupcakes. I opened it up and nothing was inside. Oh, oh no, 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 you opened the box. Why did you open the box? I told you not to open the box. Quick, take it back. I can't open I didn't this. open the goddamn box. Hey, what are you doing? I thought you wanted your box back. I went through a lot of trouble getting that. Yeah, we had to find this girl in Mudpaw and then make her a doll that looked like me, then trade the doll for the box. Honestly, it was a bit roundabout. Do you know what you've done? You've unleashed the power inside this ancient prison, and now... It will consume your very soul. Okay, Reed. I really think it's time you went inside and got some sleep. I think... Wait. What's happening to me? There's something... Something wrong with me. Reed, what was that? What's going on? I feel... I feel... Weak. Like something's sucking the life right out of my body. It's already started. Oh, why did you have to open the box? I said not to open the box! Look, let's not dwell on the whole who opened the box thing. The box was open. That's in the past. We can't change that. We should be focusing on the future and, you know, less about me. The presence inside this box, it latches onto your soul, tries to take over your mind. The only way to stop it is to break the barrier between body and soul. In other words, Dust, you will need to kill yourself. Reed! It really is the only way, Dust. It mustn't take too long, or, or you could end up like me. You know what? I love this plan. I'm happy to be a part of it. <sighs> Shut up, Fidget! I can feel my life draining away every moment. Reed, what do I have to do? Travel outside the village, pick a fight with some monsters, and lose. If you do it in time, the presence latched onto your soul will be shaken loose and returned to the box, and you will return back to your normal self. That is, assuming you do it in time. Just, you can't seriously be considering. Fidget, I don't have time to argue. I can feel it draining my life away. We need to get out of the village and fast. Wait, what the fuck? What the hell? This is actually a real thing? That's crazy. I thought he was just like fucking around. Dude. The box is genuinely evil. That's actually kind of cool. Here I was about to talk, like talk a bunch of shit. Dude, I can't even get out of town. I can't. I can't. I can't get out of town. I, I'm trying. Trust me. I'm trying. I'm trying my darndest. Run to the right. Run to the right. Hurry the fuck up. Uh, run to the right. Run to the right. Trying to get as far as I can. Uh huh. I thought he was joking. I thought it, I thought I thought Dust was just gonna play along and be like, "Oh, see the box, it's hurting me," and then Reed would be happy, and then that would be it. But no, this is legitimately hurting me. It's kind of silly, but funny at the same time. Ironically funny. Um, I don't know if we're supposed to literally lose on at on purpose, but uh, I think it's gonna happen either way. This place will be nice because there's a save point right away, just in case we need to use it. I'm still dying badly. Um, hopefully we can find a save point like right away here. No, don't you fucking dare, game. Ah, stop it. Stop it. Stop it! I can't even heal on purpose. I can't heal on purpose. It won't let me. Oh my god. I, I'm wondering if I'm supposed to like just let it happen. It's seeming like I'm just supposed to let it happen. 
Just let it happen, I guess. The natural progression of death. <laughs> Fuck you, game. I'm trying to get up there, and it's just like, no. No, you can't go up there. And I'm down to one. Now what? She's going to keep throwing me around with one health. What is it gonna? Th okay, sorry. We need to go into the menu and see what the quest said. Cause what the fuck? Uh, it was called the the box. When he learned to read it, to while well, you have a uh, the demon, this will the only cure is to let a monster kill you. Well, shit! I just kill all the monsters in the area. Fuck! All right, hold on. We'll have to leave and come back. Cause here, I I didn't realize that was a thing. Okay, well here come get me, monsters. There we go. Yay, we did it. We did it. Are you okay now? I think so, yeah. As soon as I took that killing blow, I felt something. Like a weight lifted. We should check in with Reed. Yeah. The sooner you get rid of that box, the better. Agreed. Wow, that was actually kind of interesting that that turned out to be like a real evil box. I thought he was just, you know, one of those paranoid fucking... Weird freaks. Maybe it was his evil box and he's actually the evil one just handing it out to people like, oh, don't look in that box, knowing full well that anyone who gets that box will look in it and become cursed. He did it on purpose. His paranoid bitch ass did it on purpose. I know it. I can feel it to be true. I know these things. I actually have no idea. But still, anyways, let's go talk to his bitch ass real quick. Yo, your box. It's good. You're right, Reed. Somehow that killing blow managed to shake the presence free. I'm back to my normal self again. I'm glad that's the case. Anyway, I was planning on using this revival stone on you if my plan didn't work. But it should still serve as an adequate reward. Cool. Wait, what do you mean if your plan didn't work? Well, it did, didn't it? So now I have no use for this revival stone, and you can take it. Hopefully you'll never have to use it. Yes. Well, you keep that box under lock and key. We're just lucky that kid down in Mudpot had the common sense not to open it. I will never let it out of my sight again. It's my burden to bear, after all. Good luck, Dusty. What else whispers to me? No. No, it can't be. The trees? The trees themselves whisper an ancient song. Somebody must chop them all down to silence their lies. Goodbye, Reed. I'm not playing your paranoia games anymore. You want to chop all the trees down? Be my guest. You'll probably die before you even get a, like a millionth of the way. So you have fun with that. In the meantime, I'll take your two revival stones. Yay for me. Okay, so on the positive note, we got full health from that. From going through that and then dying on purpose. So that was nice. I haven't had full health in a while. That's one positive to take from the death that we had to waste. Um, as for the rest of this episode, we have a few more minutes. Let's go ahead and check out the Sorrowing Meadow. Do I, I feel like I want to go back to the Glade, but I want to make sure I can climb on vines, because I feel like there was vines back there. I'll wait till I have the vine climbing ability, then we'll go back to the Glade and hopefully wrap that place up. In the meantime, let's check out this new area, which is called Chapter 3, Love. Ooh, are we going to fall in love? figured we'd go to a new area because you know there's gonna be a save point like right away if not a couple of them um this place looks dark and dreary yo what are you doing here bro i was looking for you earlier dust dust is that you mate augustine what are you doing that was his name augustine why i'm heeding the call of grand adventure venturing forth to seek my fortune in the wilds of this great untamed wilderness actually cora asked me to show her the way to some old meadow the sorrowing meadow Right, that's it. Never was straight with names and faces and words. Did she say why she wanted to come here? This place is pretty bleak. Nope. Just asked me to show her the way. As soon as she wandered into the meadow, this crazy magic barrier showed up. Right in convenience, that is. Looks like we're not getting up these mountains, then. You say Cora just wandered off into the meadow? She may not look it, but she's a speedy little bugger. Right. Well, we'd better go look for her. This meadow isn't safe. Augustine, if you're not going to go back to Aurora, you'd better wait here. Way ahead of you, mate. I wait around better than anyone. Good luck out there. I'm the most useless person I've ever met. And that's saying that's saying a lot. I've met millions of people, and I'm still more useless than all of them. That's what that's what I heard from Augustine. 
Fucking useless bastard. All right, for this era, uh, man, this episode, I feel like we didn't do shit. We're at 52% now. That's an indicator. Um, we moved along 5% in this episode, and I didn't even do shit but finish a couple quests. Whatever, I'll take it. All right, in the next episode, we'll explore the meadow some more. I was going to do that in this episode, but, man, I wasted a lot of time. Whatever. Get over it. See you guys next time. Peace!